If you're filming with an external video recorder or camera monitor like the Atomos Ninja 5, you really need an HDMI cable clamp to use with your camera cage. This one is by Small Rig and it's the A17. So anytime you're looking for an HDMI cable clamp, you need to make sure it's compatible with the specific cage that you have. So check your manufacturer's website, whether it's Condor Blue, Small Rig, or Tilta, and make sure that the cable clamp you get is compatible. The reason you need an HDMI cable clamp is because it helps to keep the HDMI cable secure when you're recording video on an external recorder like the Atomos Ninja 5 or a different video recorder or monitor. It'll keep your signal from dropping out and it'll also protect the HDMI jack on your camera, which can be really difficult to get fixed. So you wanna take care of that. It also will prolong the life of your HDMI cable. You notice if I don't use a clamp, there's quite a bit of play there with the cable. So to use the HDMI cable clamp, just attach it to your camera cage loosely to get started. And I recommend looking up your camera cage model number and making sure whatever different HDMI cable clamp you get is actually compatible with it. I'll have links to all that I'm using with my A7 IV in the description below. So you want that cable clamp to be on loose so that you can get your HDMI cable plugged in. Then once you have it plugged in, you just gently tighten the knob there. You can even use the Allen wrench head to get it really tight if you don't want it to slip out at all. I find that finger tight is always good with these. Then once you have it in, you notice that now the HDMI cable doesn't move anymore. So that just greatly reduces the risk of ruining a video recording because now this is tight. If you really want to make sure that your recording is safe, I also recommend getting a cage for your camera monitor. You find one that has the HDMI clamp built in there as well because that'll keep it extra secure. But now we're protecting our camera body from having an HDMI jack that's damaged by using this cable clamp. So I highly recommend getting one if you're using a cage, if you're using an external video recorder or even a monitor, it's just gonna make your setup that much more secure and ensure you don't have any signal loss from your HDMI port to your monitor. I have links for all the gear in this description below that I'm using with my a7 IV and this mini rig. So check the description for all the different links for all the products in this video. If you have any questions about HDMI clamps or why you need one, leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer them.